Hello, hey guys, um, it's just a video about tour camp. Um, placed an order, it was uh, January 2020. Um, got it a couple of days ago. I've already unboxed it, but we'll kind of do an unboxing video. Uh, it was quite quite a wait, but obviously COVID and Corona kind of um, held up the supply chains. Um, one or two things that uh, the guys at tour camp needed to sort out, but yeah, patience pays off, I guess. Um, over a year is worth the wait, but I think it'll be worth it. So, uh, this tour camp is going to be paired with um, an Owen Developments uh, custom GBT turbo. Um, it will be installed in a Fiat Abarth 500, uh, 1.4 litre engine. Um, it's a big turbo, so the primary goal for this tour camp is to uh, aid spool, basically. Um, so, got a vacuum hose here, vacuum line, to it for intake pressure. Um, I think this is a bypass valve. So, um, quite a nice piece. quite clean, welds look pretty good. Then you've got your um, valve there basically. So this is a bypass valve. So the big big turbo will be basically connected to this end. Torque cap will be here. As pressure gets to a certain point as programmed by the ECU, so we'll be using an aftermarket ECU by ECU Master. Um, the torque cap should uh, basically switch off and as soon as the mass flow uh, gets to a certain point the valves will open up and start pushing basically um, oh, by the way the, the package didn't come boxed like this it was much more well presented in two separate boxes um, I've just put it in here just to space basically. So you've got cables here, you've got the uh, button here to enable tool cam, see there, see there, and then you've got the pedal switch in here I believe, no it's the user input cable, so that's that, and there's the cables for the control box which I have as well. Um, some spares I think these are for if you want to help shorten the cables because they're quite long um, depending on if you've got a longer short car the Abarth is pretty short so potentially look at shortening these cables which are quite long got two sets of these these long cables um, this one goes from the power box to the kind of controller I believe it is this one here take this out Tool camp so that's the end that goes into the uh, turbo and then this one you use the extension that they provided, which uh, eventually goes into the power box. By the way, this power box, I think it's the updated version for Tour Camp. Um, it's, you'll, you'll see the size of it in a minute when I open it, but it's, it's really nice. It's, it's, it's a fairly small size. There's maybe This is quite big actually, yeah, it's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. I think it's the same uh, compressor size as a GT2871, uh, I believe, from the measurements and, and housings and what they told me with the 5 kilowatt motor. So this will give it a, pretty much an instant 0.4 bar pressure, uh, basically boost. So that will help with um, that will help with spool for the B 
big turbo. I haven't got the big turbo with me at the moment. This is another set of long cables. This one links the power box. Um, the, the power box to the battery. So the 48 volt battery is in the power box, which is there. Um, so that connects to it. And then the other end then connects to your 12 volt battery. So that's that. Get that out of the way. And then the power box. I'm just gonna put this down one sec. Um, very nice power box actually and to kind of put things into perspective in terms of size you put the turbo against it pretty much you know tells you kind of how, how big or small it is my hand as well so um, on where the fans are just for cooling you have to keep two centimeters clear so you've got basically what, three, three sides one two three so it can be mounted on its side like that with two centimeter clearance on these sides or flat on the back A nice um, uh, installation manual. Um, there are uh, a good uh, advice and tips in there in terms of uh, what size engine uh, you have, um, when uh, when it should be programmed in terms of when uh, boost should kick in, uh, what uh, RPM for which engine size, um, instructions about cabling everything together. Oh, to show you. Control box. So this one can be programmed. Control box. So this hooks up to um, some one of the switches. You cable it in here, I believe. Um, and then you can put in uh, intake and for pressure. So basically, uh, what what we will probably do is program the ECU, um, the ECU master in your black. Um, with a separate table and send it to this via PWM signal or something like that. Um, so yeah, uh, this can be programmed with uh, Arduino which is an open source um, programming software. Um, but that's it really. Um, what else have I missed? be under your pedal and as soon as you put your foot down give you instant instant boost um, that's it guys um, apart from that yeah those who are waiting um, persevere the guys who didn't wait it's unfortunate because uh, the tour camp were getting around to it but it's understandable if you wanted to cancel um, but yeah for me it was definitely worth the wait um, uh, everything looks to be in decent quality to be fair for, for, for the price you pay um, and the fact that there's not many if at all quality electric turbo products on the market um, I think it was worthwhile so yeah probably maybe do a update video on the installation see how it goes um, and yeah catch up soon guys Take it easy, bye.